Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Hope you are doing fantastic. And today we got another subscription box. This will come to us from Hunt Vault. But before we get into it, make sure you are subscribed to the channel and ring the notification bell so you do get notified when I upload new content. And with that, friends, Hunt Vault. You ready to get elite? We're about to get elite. Let's do it. All right, guys, so we are back with Hunt Vault Elite. And as always, if you are interested in this particular subscription box, I will have a link to them in the description box of this video. They are a veteran-owned and family-owned company. You know, so, yeah, this we're off to a good start here. But they also give veteran discounts. So if you are a veteran, reach out to them. They'll hook you up with a discount. This box is monthly. It does run you, what, $160 per month. If you give them a 12-month commitment, they will drop it down to $150 a month on that commitment. So, yeah, very good. And I only got one box to choose from. You just go there and you get the Elite. You, you know, it's the only box I got. So, yeah, that's what you're going to get. All right, let's see what we got here. Okay, True Glow. Okay, when brightness counts. Okay, so we got some self-adhesive targets, and this looks like a gobbler there. You know, there, there's a depiction on the back. Let's see if I can get it without the glare on it. You see there, what, what, what we got kicking on the front? I was kind of wondering what this was, because, you know, just kind of looked like some vertebrae action going on right here, and, I, you know, you can't really tell. Man, that, that's, old, that's old gobbler right there. So, yeah, if you want to work on your shots on, you know, getting them gobblers, you know. Yeah. All right. I wonder, oh, okay, oh, wait, there are, right, wait, 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 hold up, wait a minute, let me put some pimping in it, kit includes six individual targets, but they have different ones depicted here, uh, no glare, no glare, see, they got three depicted here, so I, I'm wondering, do they give you all three of these, because that would be cool, although this one looks bigger, it says the targets are available in many different size uh, and design, all right, so this obviously is not it, how many of them is in here? Six. Okay. Quarter inch grid system. That's that's kind of cool, you know, to have the grid system on the target like that. No glare. To have, you know, all the grid system on it. That, that's, that's pretty neat. That's pretty cool. You know, and, and the reason why that's cool is because, you know, you can verify, you know, you can do, you can do a little bit of, of mathematics on, you know, where your visual indication for your impact was and then where your impact ended up. So, you know, you do have this kind of reference grid on the target here, which is which is kind of cool. And also, well, I didn't open the box, but this is the standard box. And like up here on the top shelf, I've got all the cutouts of these boxes that have the targets on the back. So I'm really, really stoked about that. I'm really stoked that they went back to this box because that's, that's really, really cool. Okay, so that was covering. Okay, I don't need to look at all that. Okay, this is February. Don't judge. It's February. 2024 Elite Collection. All right. So here's the card that they give you. And we do have <clears throat> we do have prices. So that's awesome. So here's the card. I'm not going to take a look at this. We'll do that at the end. So I showed you so you guys can have a have a one-up on me. Let's see what we got here. A little super hanger. Float uh, folds flat for easy transport. Uh, folding support arm provides unmatched strength. Okay, what are we doing with this? It's just it's just something that goes into a tree. Patented design. Okay. Uh, accessory hook for holding game calls, uh, rattling antlers, or binoculars. Super strong machine mounting screw will not break. Okay. So apparently, this is it gives you these dual hooks. With this upper, is it an upper support? And it's got a caution sign here that says not for uh, support of a human weight. Of human weight. So yeah, this is not, you're not going to be dangling off this. But they give you this screw in that has these two hooks on it. Hooks. And then you got this hook right here, which is this little single guy right there. So, yeah, you just, you know, if you're in your tree stand, you know, and, and you need some, some hooks to 
be super fancy you know if you want to get the cadillac you know build a cadillac kind of layout and you want to have all your stuff hanging off the tree up there with you i guess this is something that's going to help aid in that i would suppose although i really can't understand what this depiction is right here this picture right here i see the little the little duma the little duma flotcher here but there's all kind of pulleys and stuff off of it and i, I don't understand what is that a bow i'm assuming i'm assuming that that's a bow but man that's a weird looking bow no because that's that's steel cable what what is going on here I would have thought maybe it's a maybe it's a crossbow or something. I don't know. I, I don't know. Does it say like how much it'll Okay, locate a spot on the tree that uh your bow will hang. Okay, so that yeah, it was a bow. But that that looks like a piece of steel cable. Or or okay, maybe it just looks that way. Okay, I, I'm dumb. I'm dumb. Okay, so moving on. All right, so tree stand buddy system hooks accessorize love it okay shotgun shell holder with pouch i have one of these already okay this this just you know goes on the the back end of your stock put shells in it and there you go so yeah and like i said i already have one of these uh you know what you know what that means don't you if i already have one you know what that means don't you that means if someone wants this could be something that i put in a giveaway that's right, because I already have one of these. Uh, let's see. There's a picture that you kind of got to get up in there to see. There's a picture right there of, of what you do. Uh, you know, very simple. You got some closures back here with some Velcro. Adjust to whatever, you know, your, your size is. And it holds, and then you got the, you got some, some stretchy stuff right here to put the, put the shells in. And then, you, then the, you got, actually got a little compartment. So you got a compartment that zips up. And how many how many does it hold one what three one two three it looks like three uh let's see what they say about that we'll, we'll, we'll read about this on the little card but i already have one of these i believe it might be this exact same one so we'll, we'll have to revisit this when i go through some stuff over there see what she do okay we got some articulating reattachable cable retainers for your sunglasses man that's kind of cool that's kind of dope I don't use these things, but I might now since I got a pair of them. Yeah. So these are, yeah. These are just little things, you know, you put them on the end. You hook them to the, you hook them to the ends right here of your glasses. And, you know, if you're, if you're doing all this and you're in combat and you're, you know, fighting off the zombies, you know, you don't want your shades to go flying off. So you hook these to the ends and they keep it on you. You know, they keep from going around your neck. So yeah, all right. And they give you another pair, which I guess are more customizable. Yeah, they're thinner. So I guess th these are for, you know, whatever size um, arms you got. So yeah, that's cool. All right, cool. What we got here? We got some beef jerky. All right. Some bourbon. Premium beef. Anthem. Veteran owned and operated. All right, that's cool. This is meat ready to eat. M-R-E. It is gluten-free, no MSG. Is 100% premium beef, as opposed to that not premium beef that you get at Taco Bell that gives you massive diarrhea. I'll tell you what, something's funny. I had a guy comment on my MRE video, like the highest view video I have on my channel, which amazingly still gets views. And I had said I had made a joke on there about all of the little quips that people make about MRE. You know, MRE like meals rejected by Ethiopians and all this kind of stuff but i had a guy comment steven he says mre massive rectal explosion there you go now i've heard it's the opposite they make you constipated they don't really i guess if you get so never mind you get so constipated you know explode never mind all right so anyway this this is some this is some anthem premium beef jerky man some bourbon uh I, i've never seen this brand before and you know that's something i have noticed in the uh, past like what two years man there's a lot of people popping up with with beef jerky you know all this crazy flavors and and all that and i've tried i've tried some of it and you know i don't know i'm just a 
very vanilla guy. You know, I just like, just give me some good peppery beef jerky. I'm, I'm good. I don't need all that fancy stuff. And, but however, this says it's handcrafted using barrel aged fine bourbon. Whew. Okay, man. I don't know. This might have to get my buddy involved with this right here with some bourbon. Might have to do that. Might have to do that. Okay, we got some Oakleys. And we got a big thing here. What is this? What is this? Ice Mule Clear. What is it? Is this like a nine cans or three 750 milliliter bottles plus ice? Okay, so this is some kind of storage bag. Storage bag. An Ice Mule Jaunt. Nine liter. And it is clear, as you can tell. But apparently you put... That, 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 target, target, bam, 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 somewhere, bam, 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 yeah. All right, let's see what we got here. We're going to look at these Oakleys in a minute. We're going to get to what's in this bag here, let's see what we got. And um, I don't know when this video is going to go up. I'm recording it on Saturday, but it's, man, it's, it's already late, man, it's already 7.30. I may put it up real late tonight if I do. And notification goes off. I apologize if it goes up late. I'm sorry. I've been busy. You know, because apparently everything's coming to a crash Monday with this, with this, 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 what you, what you, you know, whatever going on in the sky. Supposedly it's going to be the end of everything. So, you know, whatever. I'm getting sick of hearing about it. I can't wait till, till, till Monday's come and gone. To be honest with you. All right, so here's what we got. This is a big dry bag. We got a vent here, and here's the here's the part that you roll up. Here's the part that goes over your shoulders. Here's the thing that goes up against your back. And yeah, it's just a big old, it's just a big old bag. But I don't understand what what's what's so special about this bag here that this material is it more suited for ice and drinks we're gonna find out when we read the card but it's just big old i mean super thick super thick clear stuff and it says ice mule which you know obviously if it says ice it's gonna be keeping it cold or making it cold or something let's see ice mule coolers.com okay this this card tell me this, i know this card's got some flim flam up in here Sporting events, concert venues all around fun, which is cool because, you know, to go to concerts, you got to have something that's kind of transparent. Uh, you know, they won't let you in with a with a regular bag. So this, this you can see through it. So, yeah, that, that's cool. Okay, it's okay. Well, that's telling you how to how to fold the bag down. Okay. Well, but well, where's all the marketing flam? Here we go. Here's all the marketing flam. I knew it was somewhere. Okay, air's ability to insulate from heat is about 25% as efficient as foam insulation. This means that the clear ice, the, the, that the clear, I guess the C-L-E-A-R is, is some, something that they got going on. It says it will keep ice cooled contents for about 25% as long as its ice mule siblings like the Classic or Pro. So this is apparently in a, in a line, a family of products. So it says after extensive testing... Not just one or two. Extensive, exhausting testing. It says we can guarantee that with a proper filling and closure, you will get five to seven hours of ice cold beverages for all those times when only a clear bag will do. All right. All right. So we got some we got some flim flam here saying this is gonna keep keep uh, keep your stuff cold. There you go. All right. Let's check out the card because they got prices on here. Oh wait wait wait. We look at the glasses yet. Let's look at these, uh, let's look at these Oakleys, man. I just got me a pair, I just bought a pair of sunglasses from Wiley. You know, uh, they're not, I don't know why I'm looking around, I know they're not in here. But yeah, I, I got me a pair, and I'm skeptical because I like going to the sunglass places because I like putting them on and, you know, so I bought these offline. And that, that was, it was a gamble. I wish they were a, a little thinner frame, you know, but, but, you know, they're, they're good, so... So it's, it's, it's cool. Matter of fact, the frame look almost exactly like these. Okay, so these are some Oakleys. 
And let's see what what, what we got here. We got some good some good polar some good polarization going on. All right. Oh, and I like them. They're they're I mean they're plastic. You know. All right. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see what I look like here. I think these look just like uh just like the ones that I got. Except that the, the lenses, I think, are a different cut. Now, check that out, man. Now, you see, you go back to the MRE video I was just telling you about. My beard came down about right here, man. With these glasses on, man, it looked like ZZ Top. Okay. All right. And I can't see the viewfinder, so I don't know how I looked. I might look dumb. I don't know. I'm pretty sure you guys in the comment section will let me know what's up. But, hey, man, pair of Oakleys, man. We love it. Love that. Have to get them out in the sun, man. See what they do. Which is nice because I've lost two pairs of sunglasses. I haven't lost them, but I've had them damaged real bad at car shows. I had one pair. I walked into the arm of our of our awning on our tent. I, I kind of got up and I didn't realize it was right there. And I turned and I ran into it and it just bam and it messed my one pair of sunglasses up. And then I had another pair get messed up at another car show. So yeah holy what oakley man these things ain't camo they, they look they look uh they just look gray like grayish grayish black ish like i didn't see no camo are these camo how is that camp oh okay okay so i guess if you put any kind of little lines on it I don't even know if that's going to show up. I say that every time, and usually you guys can see. But there's little lines on there, so that's camo. Oh, man. They should just put tactical on there, too. I mean, why not? Just put camo, tactical, NASA tested. I, I don't know. Oh, man. Okay. But here's the thing. Here's the thing I'm freaking out about. 200 bucks now mind you this box is 160 if you buy it month to month 150 if you get it on 12 months so these glasses they say these glasses 200 bucks it says they're oakley camo crankshaft polarized sunglasses 200 bucks okay it says that they're the go-to choice for outdoorsmen designed to filter out 99 percent of reflective glare minus the haze and distortion that typically comes with uh conventionally manufactured polarized lenses tested under extreme circumstances to ensure uncompromising protection across a wide range of demanding conditions there you go did i sell you on that yet all right moving on we got the ice mule clear insulated cooler 90 bucks nine zero 90 bucks for that that lit that uh that dry bag okay it says ice mule has developed the ultimate in clear cooler technology Ideal for bringing your favorite beverages on the go or in the field. This first of its kind, air insulated, ultra portable and reusable cooler was designed for sporting event venues, concert areas, and other locations which require clear bags for entry. Like I said, why do I know about clear bags for entry? Well, well, you know, my wife and, and my oldest daughter, you know, they went to see Walker Hayes down at the wharf in Orange Beach. And, and you know, you got to have clear everything's got to be clear you got to have clear well getting having clear will get you through faster to theme parks you know because security can just look at it without having to dig you know dig through all your crap so there you go but it says air insulated technology and it's a dry bag so it's a dry bag you know the dry bag you know indicates that you're you're how is it air insulated i mean it, it, am i missing something is is this some kind of martian material is this from area 51 this is probably off the skin of one of them uh you know one of them ufos okay i'm gonna believe them okay then we got the hunter specialty shotgun shell holder 13 bucks okay 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 it, it it provides easy access to three shotgun shells and includes a zipper pouch for additional ammo and other accessories there you go 13 dollars. okay so that's I'm not gonna argue okay then we got the true glow turkey targets 12 by 12 
Ten bucks. Ten bucks. How many did I say was in there? Like six? Whew, man, targets are expensive. All right. I'm cheap, man. I just go out there with some spray paint. I draw my own gobbler up there, you know, with a spray paint can. Just draw a zombie head, you know, and just go to town. Okay, then we got the Crokey's uh, Terra System Cord, which, you know, which is cool because they gave you the sunglasses. So that's kind of cool. These little bad boys here, 10 bucks. It says, Climbing Rope Meets Interchangeable End Technology with a line of Terra System Retainers. Setting the standard for toughness and versatility. Designed to accompany you across a wide range of outdoor activities. Compatible with any frames and adjustable. Terra System Retainers will always keep your sunglasses secured. Yeah. There you go. Ten bucks. Okay, now we got the Hunting Made Easy Little Super Hangers. These things that I don't really understand because, how many, I mean, you're taking so much crap in a tree stand. Uh, okay. All right. Eight bucks. Well, at least they're not expensive. So there's that. And they're not expensive. Uh, let's see. Super Hanger Arm You Know and Love now features a dual-pronged accessory hook with, uh, which provides a great place to hold calls, binoculars, rattling antlers, quiver, etc. Accessories, uh, accessory hook can be used as a pilot hole mounting arm to increase the weight tolerance. Okay, we'd like to tolerate more weight, so that's cool. It incorporates a patented no-unscrewing design. A no-unscrewing design. I'd like to know how that works. All right. Okay, so that's eight bucks. So, like I said, it's not uh, it's not expensive. So that that's cool. Okay, then we got the Anthem Bourbon Beef Jerky for six bucks, and this is two point five ounces for that six bucks, or seventy one grams. It says this recipe this re recipe eat infuses Anthem's tender beef with just the right hint of bourbon to create a sweet and bold tasting jerky. One hundred percent premium beef, slow cooked to perfection in small batches using real wood smoke. Gluten-free, no MSG. Oh, man, no MSG, man. MSG make everything taste good, man. man. I like me some MSG. High in protein. This jerky is fuel you'll need to carry you forward. 10% of Anthem's profits. Uh-oh, go to veteran and first responder nonprofit organizations. There you go. And it says, you know, it's owned by some, some uh, veterans. Yeah. So they give 10% back, man. 10% back to veteran and first responder nonprofit organizations. So, yeah, okay. So it's a good recipe. You know, we got some, you know, bourbon-infused beef jerky. Love it. Okay, guys, this was Hunt Vault from February 2024. Let me know what you think in the comment section down below. Look forward to seeing you down there, man. Hey, if you're new here, subscribe to the channel. Hey, give me a thumbs up on the way out the door. I'd really greatly appreciate you, man. For real. For real. Still love my little knife here, man. A little donut. Yeah. Hey, hang on a second. Hang on a second, man. got to... Got to dab my sweat. Got to dab my sweat. Yeah, check that out. All right, I'm going to ramble for just a minute. If you're out of here or you're already gone, thanks for hanging out. Appreciate you. You're awesome. All right, I'm out of here. Peace, guys. Peace. Peace to you. Okay. All right, it's cool getting a pair of glasses. I, I'm really, I do, I really, it's hard for me not to, to just open this beef jerky right now. But I, I think I'll wait for, I'll wait for my buddy and we'll get some, and we'll get some bourbon and we'll drink a little bit, talk a little crap, eat a little beef jerky. That sounds like a better plan than me doing it sitting in here by myself. Uh, let's see. I, I haven't, I've been MIA for a little bit because I got a lot of stuff going on because, you know, like I said, the end's coming with this, uh, this weird occultation that we're having going on Monday, which to me is, is hilarious. It's hilarious, man. I find it real funny. Okay, so let's see. Let's see what we got. What are you guys talking about? Uh, well, I, I, you know, it's weird how this, this system on YouTube works because I will get tons of... I'll start getting views on really old videos because people will comment on videos that I made like two years ago. So it, it's just weird how this cycle kind of goes and goes and goes. But let's see, from my monthly knife club video, I got a gentleman uh, because, you know, they made a, a statement 
on their little card saying it was something designed by NASA or something. So a guy, uh, Dark Wolf, uh, comment he said military grade nasa designed he said this description was created by a civilian marketer i'm sure i'm ex-military and contracted for nasa neither description is positive to anyone who actually knows better and that's why you find it so funny Brad. so i do find stuff like this really really funny because we you know in the industry we work in you know that that stuff just it's really funny it's really funny then i had another gentleman i um, hoping this is he says salute brad he's from france so that's that's really cool i've been I've been I've been to the France before, so yeah I, I've been I don't know where where you're at in France. It says on the Gerber it's a bit holder. Okay, so so it he, we were talk I was talking about this Gerber and his okay this this tool right here that looks like a looks like some kind of scaffolding piece. He says this is a bit holder, so I do have a bit right here. Well, actually I got another one right here. He says it's a bit holder. Uh, let's see. Okay. 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 It will go. Okay. It will go in there, but boy, that is, that is rough. That's, that's really difficult to get in there. But yeah, it, it is a bit holder. Now it did, to be fair, it did kind of, it did kind of bow them things out a little bit, but a bit did go in there and yeah, it would hold it. Okay. But just, you know, just from how wide the opening is, this these bits anyway they won't they won't they won't slide down in there easy but you can force it and you can get a bit in there and it would hold it enough to to use it so that's 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 really really good that's really good man i appreciate you for that because i have no idea what that's for and when i read your comment and you said a bit holder i said well wait a minute man that that makes a lot of sense and it said and he says uh further that the bits are delivered with, with the multi-tool, or you have to order them separately, and I don't know how that happens in the U.S. So, yeah, good good, good looking out, man. All the way from France, man. I got somebody from France schooling me. That's awesome, dude. I, I, really, I really like that, man. Uh, let's see. In France, I went... I got friends over in Great Britain, so I, I went all over England and everything, and I went to Dover... Because I wanted to see Dover Castle, and you know, I wanted to see the White Cliffs of Dover, and I took an auto ferry across the channel there to Calais, in France. So that that you know, I went to Calais. That that was it, you know, and I went all around Calais. So, so yeah, but I loved it. I really loved it. Okay, and Pew Prep Trek says really hot chicks with the toe thumbs, and he said, uh, "Say what?" Uh, okay, so I read your comment, and, and I, uh, I'll elaborate for you. Uh, the 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 t the toe thumb chick. Is uh, what's her name? The chick that played in the first uh, Transformer, Megan Fox. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, she got two thumbs because it was a big old deal. I remember from the first transform that first Transformers movie where you know because she she's hot. She was hot in that movie, and and everybody said yeah she's hot, but man she got the two thumbs. And I'm like what? I kind of did like you did. I was like what are you talking about? And then you see pictures. Yeah, but, whew, man. Yeah, okay. I just had to wear some gloves or something, man, for real. But I did want to talk about this because Pew Prep Trek, since I mentioned him anyway, he gave me this cool Olight, Olight pen. Okay, well, when I open this thing, this pen, which has the donut theme to it, okay, I thought that, you know, you turn it on like this, and it's just a light right here, and it's a, it's a pen. It's just a regular pen, right? No. That's the, That's just the tip of the iceberg of what this pen will do. So check this out. Okay, so if you if you don't deploy the pin, but you push up on the little release mechanism here to get the pin out, you push up on it. Check that out. There's a green laser. You got a green laser. Okay, and that's 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 just from that. Okay, then if you deploy the pin, okay. If you deploy the pin and then hit the, the activate button, there's a light that's inside the end of the pin. So when you're writing in the dark, you can write in the dark because you can see it puts enough illumination, you know, right where you, you would be writing to see. So that's cool, right? Okay, then if you retract the pin and if you turn this light right here on, 
Okay, and you hold it, see it'll cycle. It's got all these different brightness levels. And it will flash. Now, it doesn't flash like SOS or anything. It just, you know, it just, you know, blinks. So, yeah, you know, a lot of different functionality that I didn't even know it had. I just thought it was a little, you know, on-off light. But no, it's a lot more than that. And, and the little charging base here is what I thought. You just... And they actually give you a, I don't know why I keep saying actually, they give you a magnet that you can put on your desk. You can, it's got, you know, self-adhesive. And then if you don't want to use that, this is self-adhesive. So you can just stick it down like that to hold it. And then you just drop the pin in it and a little light comes on and it charges it just like that. That's freaking awesome, dude. I love this thing. This, this pin is, is, is something else, man. I really love it. But yeah, find out that it had all that, all that different stuff in it was, was really, really neat. I really thought it was cool. So, yeah. But, you know, it's old light, so I, I should have known better. I should have known that it had all kind of different functions and everything. So, yeah, I've been going through my stickers and everything. Let's see, did I change anything? I don't think I did. I don't think I did. Nope, I didn't. All right, well, if you have if you hung out with me this long, uh, let me know what you think about this uh, occultation that's coming up. You know, uh, Monday. We well, you know what your thoughts about it from a, I don't know, spiritual aspect. I mean, do you think it has any significance? Because you know, a lot of people in the in the religious realm seem to think it 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 means something. Uh, I think it's just a, a sign of of things that happen. I, you know, I don't think it's you know. I'm not really worried about it. I think it's going to be another Monday. Hopefully it won't be a crappy Monday. You know what would not make it a crappy Monday? If if I win the lottery tonight or if I win the lottery Monday. That would make it not crappy. All right, but that's it. That's all I got. I'm going to get out of here. I'm going to try to bust out a couple more videos uh, because, let's see, I'll, I'll, be, I'll be good to go this coming week. But the, the week after, the week after this coming week, uh, I uh, my wife's going to be going into the hospital. So... The, I will not, you know, and I'll, I'll probably mention this again uh, coming up, you know, into that because she's going to be going for surgery and and all that kind of stuff. So, yeah. But I hope all of you guys are doing well. And sound off in the comment section. Let me know about anything I've rambled about, talked about, shown in this video. Hunt, hunt, vault, thumbs up, you know, whatever. And I will see you guys in the next one, man. Stay cool, man. Peace.